How's everybody? I've got a couple of things. First of all, T-Baby, I see is doing an interview over there. But I want to thank you for having the leadership to organize this group. This is what it's all about. We have to step up as the people of East St. Louis and say enough is enough when it comes to the killing. Enough is enough when it comes to the gang banging and the drug war. We have to step up and say we can do better. I applaud everybody who's here today because we need to be carrying the message. The message is put down the pistols. Put down the AK-47s. I too, I too have spent a lot of time right here. First of all, I went to Dunbar, I went to Hughes Quinn, and I went to Lincoln. Right out here. I played football on that field right over there. I played baseball on that field right over there. My eight-year-old daughter plays on this playground at least once every week, and she's in the Mary Brown Center on a regular basis. And you know what? It's not just about my eight-year-old, but it's about all these little babies around here right now who deserve to live a better life. They deserve to live life more abundantly. They shouldn't have to be worrying about a drive-by because somebody has a vendetta with somebody else. It's time out for that. Let me say one quick thing about the clubs and what we're doing. We're not going to let just a few individuals take aim at people around the clubs and basically say it's time to put them out of business. The people who are doing the shooting would do the shooting whether they're talking about in a park, a church, a library, or any place else. So we're not going to let a few people come and say, we're shutting down the clubs. No, that's a big part of our industry. But we must do what we're supposed to do responsibly within the industry to protect ourselves. And the police are going to be there to make sure we protect ourselves. The last thing I want to mention, and I know I'm going to step on some toes when I say this, but that's all right. Number one, I agree with Judge Casey when she talked about we need some jobs in this community. When those people come from different places talking about what we need to do in East St. Louis, I want to look back at them and say, why don't you help bring an industry to East St. Louis? So we can put some of our brothers and sisters to work. If you put a person to work, you don't have to worry about them breaking in your house and carjacking you. Number two, this is where I'm going to step on some toes. Somewhere we got where it was cute to say, you don't have to go to school. Wrong answer. We need to be pushing our young people, especially these babies. I'm looking at them with the beautiful hair and all the things that they have to behold. There's a lot of brain power. We need to make sure, young men, that you are ready to get smart. We need you to be as smart as possible. We need you to help create a whole new East St. Louis. Yeah. You do that when you know something. You know something when you get in school. So we need you to stand up. The last thing for all of us, how many people here have children? For everybody whose hand went up, the next place we need to do is look in the mirror and say, what can we do as better parents? If you see your 14-year-old boy coming in the house with a Rolex watch on his hand, you need to say, son, you got to take that back wherever you got it. You see him coming in with a pistol on his hip, you need to say, son, put the pistol back wherever you got it. If you see your little girl coming in with all kinds of new hair and everything else, and you know she's not working, you need to be asking, where'd you get that money from, girl? Is somebody have you out here tricking? What's going on with you? Parents have to be parents. Parents have to be parents. Not just baby's daddy. Not just baby's mama dropping them off at grandmama's house to be taken care of. We have to step up. And I'm so glad that somebody said earlier, it's not just a one man job. It's not even a city council job. It's not a school board job. It's all of our jobs. 
to make East St. Louis a safer place. Hunt down the pistols, pick up the books, let's create some jobs, and make sure to preach the message. Don't be afraid to say, your behavior is unacceptable. When I see you standing in front of the liquor store with your pants sagging, looking to sell some dope. It's time out for that. I'm not afraid to say it. The folks who say, Parks, you better get your bodyguard. The Lord is my bodyguard. I'm not worried about it. If I die, let it be for a worthy cause. And there's no worthier cause than making sure that we save our people and that we grow our people here in East St. Louis. T-Baby, I don't know where you are. I thank you for being here. Thank you for your courage. Thank you for your leadership. And I thank everybody who's here because it says to me, you care about making sure we have a safe and healthy community. God bless you.